Welcome back, my snaily friends. My name is Lavinia. You can call me Lav. And today, we are going to make our very own DIY calcium powder. It just so happened that I made egg salad, so I had about a dozen eggshells to really utilize to make this calcium powder. You can also do this with just a couple eggshells if you don't need to make a huge amount. So the first thing you're gonna wanna do is rinse your eggshells off really well. Second, you wanna lay them all out on a baking sheet as evenly as you can. Then put them in your oven at 220 degrees Fahrenheit or 104 Celsius for 20 minutes. This will ensure that the eggshells are nice and dried out and all the moisture is completely gone so that we get a powder instead of a paste. Then take your eggshells out and ensure that they all are dry. If they're not quite dry yet, but they should be, you can put them in for another five minutes. I will suggest, if you have a coffee grinder that has never been used for coffee, you can utilize it to make this process extremely fast. I don't. My coffee grinder has been used for coffee in the past, and I didn't trust that. So we're going to go this way. I would just lean on the side of caution, and if it has been used for coffee, don't use it because the snails are going to be eating this and it is gonna go into your tank. And I don't know anyone in the aquarium hobby who likes to put coffee in their tanks. So just be wary of that. Okay, once we get all the eggshells in there, plug her in and let her rip. I ended up just pushing all of the buttons at different times and different intervals to sort of give it a wide variety of blending capabilities to really grind it down and pulverize it to as much of a fine powder as this Cuisinart <laughs> blender will allow. I think it did a pretty good job actually, which I was really excited about, but I wanted it even finer. And if you don't own a blender, this is where you would start from. Put all your eggshells into a Ziploc bag and follow along the video from here. You can see there, I just dropped a little bit of the powder into the tank next to me. That's where the spixies are and a couple of my elder snails. I figured they might enjoy it. So next I took like a pint glass and I just started rolling it on top of the eggshells in a bag. I'm not really sure how much this uh, crushed it additionally. Again, if you don't have a blender and you're starting from square one, putting your eggshells in a bag and rolling it with a rolling pin or a pint glass to begin is a really good start. Then I started going a whole nother method. I really wish I had one of those cool stone pestle and mortar things, but I don't. So I tried to recreate my own with just a glass bowl and a glass that I have here that has a nice flat bottom to it. You can see the consistency of the powder. It is pretty fine, but I want it even finer. So, I decided to start giving myself a mild case of carpal tunnel and really grind this powder down to the best of my ability. Let's speed this up, Lev. People don't have all day. And I'm showing you here that it is getting finer, but I want it even better. That's looking good. Look at that, I wish I moved that fast. All right. Now, I think that's as good as we're gonna get it using the method that I'm doing, and that is perfectly fine. So next, I just put it in a storage container. Yeah, and the easiest way for me to do that was to transfer it to the glass and then get a little baggie and transfer it into the baggie. I'm actually surprised how much we got out of a dozen eggs. I thought I would have gotten a lot less, but I was happy with the amount that we did get. Do be sure to label your bag of egg calcium so that no one might mistake it for anything else. If you, if you look really closely, you can see the dust that comes from when I transfer from container to container. I do wish I could have gotten it ground down a little bit finer of a powder, but I think what we ended up with is perfectly wonderful. <laughs> I think we did the best we could with the tools that we had. And that's pretty much it. This is just a real short video to show you how to make some of your own DIY calcium. If you have eggshells laying around, don't throw them in the trash, save them, keep them clean, and then when you have enough, you can make your own calcium powder. And here we are, ta-da! Calcium powder out of eggshells. Brilliant, looks great. You can use this in Snellos, you can sprinkle it into your tank, or you can even make a little calcium block. 
I do hope you guys give this a whirl and let me know how it goes for you in the comments down below. If you have any other suggestions on a better way or a more efficient way to crush up eggshells, I'm sure everyone would love to hear it as well. Thanks again, everyone. I really appreciate you being here. Hit that like button on your way out and I'll see you in the next one. And don't forget, hug your snails. <laughs>